For the first time, officials now say full gas restoration in the Merrimack Valley will not happen until the middle of November. In the coming weeks, up to 195 crews will be working to replace and get the system back online. Good afternoon. I'm Chris McKinnon. And I'm Kate Merrill. Thanks for joining us. Plans are now underway to install hot plates and space heaters in hundreds of homes. Brianna Pitts is here with the very latest. Brianna. Chris and Kate, Governor Baker and executives from Columbia Gas just laid out an extensive recovery plan to help thousands of residents and business owners impacted by the gas explosions. Baker has instructed Columbia Gas to hire a retired Navy officer to oversee the effort. Starting tomorrow, recovery teams will begin distributing thousands of hot plates and 24,000 space heaters to impacted residents to help with the short-term relief. The National Guard will, will help with distribution. Meanwhile, gas crews will work to repair the 48 miles of damaged pipeline in the area, and the coordinated effort will roll out over the next several weeks. We all share the same goal, which is to get people back to their normal daily life. Whether it's a hot shower, a home-cooked meal, or the ability to open up a business, we're bringing every available resource to make this happen. More than 80 homes were damaged by the fires and explosions last week. The NTSB is investigating what caused the blast. Chris and Kate. Brianna, thank you. And stay with WBZ for the latest updates on the investigation and recovery efforts in the Merrimack Valley. And for information on how to help, head to our website, cbsboston.com.